Hello, this is Dr. Patrick Porter, and I'm going to be your guide today on this 15-minute brain tap journey. Your eyes should be comfortably closed, and you're breathing now deep, rhythmic, and relaxed. With this relaxed, natural breathing process, I want you to shift your awareness down to the feet and the ankles. Notice with me now how energy itself follows thought. No two people sense, feel, or become aware of the relaxation response in the exact same way. So simply go with the flow and begin the process of letting go as your mind begins to comprehend. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Can't hear you either. <laughs> Anyways, this is the brain tap device. And I might be joking around a little bit here, but this is actually our device that's gone through a lot of research and development. Uh, Dr. Patrick Porter has put in, put in an incredible amount of work into this. And I think that it really can help people, especially people that have a hard time calming down. People that if they tried to meditate they, and sat down and tried to clear their mind, they would literally just have a panic attack. Uh, this type of technology is called uh, audiovisual entrainment. And what you can see is within the inside of the visor, there's actually LED lights that flash um, so that you get stimulation in your uh, cranial nerve one back to your brain. And then uh, obviously it's got headphones that send audio pulses through your cochlear cells, right? Uh, through your cranial nerve eight to affect the entire brain. And we're gonna talk about that. We're gonna talk about how that actually affects the overall brainwave pattern of your mind. But first, if you're interested in this type of content, make sure that you hit subscribe and click the bell so you get uh, notifications when I upload new content. Uh, and again, if you're interested in one-on-one -on -one coaching with me, go to www.techforsyke.com slash coaching. Now in the past on this channel, I've talked a lot about meditation, its health benefits, and gone down the neuroscience rabbit hole, taking a look at brain function and how oscillations of different brain circuits change during meditation to strengthen a person's ability to reach cool, calm, and collected states of mind. Now I've done a lot of this through using personal EEG devices as a discussion point, but audiovisual entrainment devices have a lot of interesting insights to offer as well. One of my past videos, I took a look at a device called Think, which is an external neurostimulator device that uses direct electrical pulses through the skin to create bottom-up neuromodulation brain patterns that can actually change your overall subjective state of mind. There's these major nerves that come out of your brain called cranial nerves that can actually be used to change global brain oscillation patterns. Think used direct pulses of electricity to modulate the trigeminal nerve through the skin. Audiovisual entrainment devices use pulses of light and sound to modulate brain activity through the visual and auditory centers of cranial nerves 2 and 8. Now taking a step back, isn't it amazing that the brain can have its whole global oscillation patterns change from these devices to affect things like attention, mood, and anxiety? I personally find that amazing. And what we should be talking about is nested synchrony. Now nested synchrony is this concept in which rhythms of the brain are nested within each other. I've talked a lot about local areas of the brain communicating to each other through fast oscillations and more remote areas of the brain communicating to each other through slower oscillations. Each of these oscillation frequencies are interacting with each other through the brain circuits in either constructive or destructive interference. Small oscillation patterns in one area of the brain can spread through the whole brain through interference patterns, and that's how these devices work, is kind of like the butterfly effect. You know, that theory where a flap of a butterfly's wings could disturb the air around it and have that compound through various means theoretically affect weather on the other side of the planet. Now that's just kind of a theory and like a metaphor of how small changes can compound into big changes, but that actually kind of does happen in the brain where you've got this small input of oscillation patterns that can spread out through the different brain circuits and affect the overall oscillation patterns globally. BrainTap specifically is the brainchild of Dr. Patrick Porter, a psychologist that I met at a conference in Hawaii who's been investigating this technology for over 30 years. Around the time stronger computer chips came out in the late 1980s, Dr. Porter was already implementing them into audio entrainment devices, one of which won the 1989 Consumer Electronics Show in Chicago as the best new gadget of the year. 
Dr. Porter combined his training of psychology and neurolinguistic programming to create a whole new library of programs for his device. After many iterations, we now have the brain tap that comes with access to a whole library of guided visualizations that can be used for, to treat everything from anxiety to addiction to weight loss to recovery from trauma, you name it. From personal use, it's very obvious that the sessions left me feeling very relaxed and peaceful. In fact, at times I almost found myself so deep in trance that I almost forgot that I was laying there in my recliner and had to bring myself back from a really deep state of relaxation because I felt like I was almost losing myself. Uh, as a provider, it was actually really nice to feel like someone was paying attention to me at once and saying things that honestly made me feel really good about myself. I actually noticed that I'd be smiling during sessions because of how nice experience was. The sessions were recorded by Dr. Porter himself and he has a great voice and rhythm for these types of guided sessions. Taking a look at the device itself, it's very high quality. The plastic is thick and sturdy, no cracks in the rubber, soft earpieces, very comfortable to wear. It was relatively easy to set up via Bluetooth to the smartphone once the user account was established. Volume buttons allow you to adjust the audio and you would think that the flashing lights might be annoying or too much through your closed eyes, but honestly, I was surprised to find that I barely noticed the lights flashing at times and when they were brighter, it was quite manageable. The music was very pleasant and the audio recordings were very interesting. The light colors themselves are very vivid and attractive and they give the device a really nice touch. In working with BrainTap, I really feel like experiences like this and meditation complement each other. I feel like familiarity with meditation helps you make these trances even deeper and less anxiety surrounding these altered states that you go into with work like this, whereas the audio entrainment experience gives you something to shoot for during your regular meditation sessions in terms of like the amount of relaxation that you can get. I've mentioned the default mode network before. It's the brain circuit that you get into when you're thinking about yourself, your trials, and your tribulations. Well, both meditation and the altered state from the audiovisual entrainment get you out of the default mode network. And we know that it strengthens different areas of the brain that don't normally communicate with each other as much as they do in everyday life. Now, does this lead to these positive self informations getting to the subconscious and affecting your everyday behavior? Uh, we can't prove that directly, but clinical experience would suggest that it does help. And the neuroscience brain imaging are definitely suggesting that at the very least, we're exercising areas of the brain that do not normally get activated during normal daily life. So there is one drawback to the device and it is price. I would encourage people to really think about their needs that they've had tried other things and have big obstacles to overcome. This device definitely could help augment other treatments that you are getting. Uh, it's a professional level device and I think the quality of the materials, the professional expertise of the audio, the quality of the audio, all these kind of contribute to that high price. And ultimately, you're going to have to decide if it's right for you or not. And I'm sure if you message the BrainTap team on the website, they can let you know where they're going to be next so you can try one out yourself so you can make a better educated decision on whether you want to make the investment on the device or not. So thanks so much for listening. This is Dr. Cody Rawl with Tech for Psych. We'll have more devices like this one coming up very soon that I can't wait to show you guys, and I'll talk to you again soon.